welcome to The Tonight Show. Thank you for being here. Uh, thank you for having me. This is your first ever late night talk show. It really is. I'm yeah. excited. Hopefully not my last. No, not definitely not last. your last. I'm kind of nervous. Uh, no, don't be nervous. Okay, okay. How, uh, how, how, uh, let's get, I want to talk about the family. How are the kids? Amazing. Yeah? Yes. Yeah. And I have to tell you that my son Cameron, who is 13 years old, is a big Jimmy Fallon fan, which was really r random for me to find out <laughs> on the way here. Really? I swear to God, I'm running down what I have to do in New York because I'm very transparent with my children. I'm of like, course. okay, I have to do this. I'll be back at this day. He's like, so what are you doing? I'm running down. I'm like, and Jimmy Fallon, what? You're doing that? That's really big, mommy. He's like, I get his notifications. I watch his YouTube. And really? I you're, he's a big fan. What's his name? Cameron Carter. Cameron! <laughs> Cameron Carter, you're a cool dude and you have the best taste in late night comedian. <laughs> I love you, Cameron. I love you, Cameron. We love <laughs> we love you, yeah, yeah, and be cool, yeah. We're cool, we're cool. Uh, let's talk about uh, your new film, You People, uh, which is so funny, and you are just a breakout in this. I mean, you're just, oh, you, you can't take your eyes off you in this. You're fantastic. Thank you. Uh, congrats. We had Kenny Barris on the show who uh, wrote and directed it, uh, and he's like, dude, get ready, watch what Lauren, she's like, She's gonna pop like Julia Roberts, and he That's keeps. That's a lot of pressure. No, but you really can't. I mean, he said he had to beg you to get to, to do the movie. Is that true? He didn't have to beg me, but I wasn't sure if this was aligned with where I was going work-wise. Oh, and it's, I just wanted to make sure that yes, the story had it was a brilliant script and it was extremely funny, yeah. but that the story had. There was more to be told than just the comedy, and I wanted to make sure that the soul was in there. Yeah. And so that those those were my concerns. You and got so, the comedy handled. I mean, you got <laughs> Eddie Murphy. Yeah, it's uh, funny, but you know, we gotta have some. Like there was, there were some questions I had as far as Jonah's character and my character, and why they would naturally connect. And yeah. it had to be more than that. They're written in a script, and it's funny, but that they were really friends first, and they. They liked hanging out with each yeah, other. Yeah, and they had a genuine connection. I was gonna say, there's some genuine yeah. moments and you felt that chemistry. Yeah. Did you know Jonah before this movie? I did not know Jonah before this movie. Um, He's great. I, Jonah is really my homeboy in real life. Like, I love me some Jonah Hill. <laughs> right? And when we first met, we met like, I think we had a meeting like a couple like a couple weeks before we shot, and there was this big ass, oh, big. <laughs> Ca Cameron, turn the channel. He knows. No, Let me say that. No. <laughs> okay, okay. He had this <laughs> big van yeah. parked in the valet, and I'm like trying to get in. I'm honking, like, who is blocking the. <laughs> and he comes out, and he's like, I'm so. I think I'm supposed to meet you today. I'm like, oh, you are. How you doing? <laughs> that's how you met. That's how we met. <laughs> that's perfect. That's perfect. Kind of goes yeah. with the movie too. It's like that type of. Oh, right. I was a great. I was. A, I was doing a lot. Yeah. Because there's right. fun friend energy, and then you go, oh, these guys are gonna fall in love. Yeah. And it's good. No, I totally felt it and got it. And yeah, I'm. I'm, I'm a sucker for any of those like rom-com things. And yeah, it's I about love... time we have another one. Yeah, it's yeah, great. Yeah. But then Julia Louis Dreyfus. Come on. I mean, I... she. she is one of the most giving and caring scene partners really? ever. She was just so welcoming to me because I was like a little intimidated. I'm like, oh my God, how am I gonna improv with these like comedic giants? Yeah. And she was just so open and encouraging and just played with me and yeah. opened up the space and ugh, I love her. Uh, how do we set up the, the movie and who you play? How do we? I know Kenya set it up real good when he came, huh? Oh yeah, no, I, know, yeah, he, I can't a... do it as good as him. So this yeah. is what I'll say. Uh, you want? Do I need to look somewhere? No. Okay. So. <laughs> <laughs> you guys. Y'all, this is my first time. No, 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 no! I don't want you to do it. No, you're crushing. You are crushing it. You are crushing it. Right okay. Now. I can help you with this. This is my job. I can okay, help you. Okay. Okay. Help me out. Help me out. Okay. So I guess you would say uh, I play a <laughs> a girl from LA, Inglewood. Yeah comes from a Muslim family that meets a nice white boy, Jewish white boy from Brentwood. Yeah, exactly, that's <laughs> And good. Um, we connect, we fall in love, and our families aren't so open to what we have going on, and yeah. so it's just... You can't control your family. No. No. No, I, we wish we could in real life, right? Yeah, you know. can't, no, exactly mm -hmm. right. But it's great, and it's funny. I think the scene we're gonna show is the first time you guys actually meet. He hops into your car thinking that you're his Uber driver. Here we go. Lord. This is Lauren London and Jonah Hill in You People. Take a look at this. Oh, my God. Oh, no. Ah, you're attacking me. Stop. Yeah. Stop. Please. Relax. Fine. Okay. 
But you're not getting five stars. No, 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 Uber driver. You're not? No, I'm not. I'm on my way to work, weirdo. I am so sorry. No, you're not. You saw a black woman in an inexpensive car and thought it was your God-given white right to get in my back seat and tell me where to go. Get out! I know this seems like a racism, Ugh. but it's not. My, my, my Uber driver is a black woman who Ugh. drives a Mini Cooper. Her name is Hyacinth Ajan Lekoko oh, wow. Rutatembe. So, okay. so I guess Hyacinth, whatever, looks like me since we all look alike. I mean, honestly, you guys are twins. Oh my God, wait, she really does look like me. Netflix this Friday. Hey, hey.